What's going on guys? Today I bring you another Destiny 2 video and today I have quite an interesting theory about what I believe is a new exotic weapon. But before we go any further, people I am giving away this resurrectionist emblem. To enter simply drop a like and leave a comment. Okay, so not many days ago I pointed out things you may have missed from all the Destiny 2 recent trailers we've seen. In that video I pointed out a new sword I believed was exotic. Now this I do believe I'm the first to spot and mention here on YouTube, but full credit does go out to a friend of mine for bringing it to my attention. Doug117 you sexy Scottish Viking looking mofo. Now you guys obviously see the sword within this trailer which this warlock is holding. What's really interesting and what I first thought was an icon, which is at the bottom end of this sword, which actually is in fact, I believe, a gyroscope, much like what we see on the Torch of Malice, and what's in the speaker's room within the tower. Now the gyroscope on the Torch of Malice is said to hold a piece of Oryx's soul, so what could be the lore behind the gyroscope seen on this sword? Now here is an interesting theory for all you to think about. The speaker has one of these contraptions within his space within the tower, this makes me think it may have something to do with him. Hear me out. The speaker as we know so far in Destiny 2 is nowhere to be seen. Where did he go upon the attack at the Red Legion on the tower? Did he die? Did he escape? Did he embody his light into this gyroscope? Who knows? Maybe the sword comes from a quest line to save the speaker which we end up failing and what's left of his soul is held within the sword's gyroscope, much like what we see within the touch of malice. Or maybe the sword is the key to finding the speaker as it holds a part of his light. Notice as well it's a warlock wielding the sword within the trailer too. Now we do know you do get a sword from the speaker within Destiny 1 and it's for completing a tale of two guardians which is a quest. During this quest you're rewarded a sword from the speaker, so the speaker and swords have tied in before. But what do you think about this? Do you think this sword could have something to do with the speaker? Do you think this sword embodies the speaker's light? Do you think it's a key to finding the speaker within Destiny 2? Do you think the speaker may have died, leaving what's left of his soul held within this sword's gyroscope? Let me know. Like I said though, this is just a theory, one to think about. If you'd like to add to this theory, be sure to leave a comment down below. If you think it's something completely different, let me know. Hope you guys did enjoy the video though. If you're new around here and enjoy daily Destiny videos, be sure to subscribe. If you never want to miss a video of mine, Make sure you press that bell button next to that subscribe button to receive email notifications. But remember people, you heard it here first, if this turns out to be true. Again, thanks for stopping by and I'll see you on the next one. Always in the wrong, knowing where we stand, but you and I will carry on. Get it right